If you know the words, the best way to do it is to go, is to, is to strum the words. I don't expect you to keep track of the bars, but I'll try and keep track with a, with a, with a heavy sort of thing. So it's, it's a, so you come in on, where you should see, you should, where, you should, where you should see, toilet in pan. The good looking, but she looks like a man. That's the bit, right? So we could just do it as a, that basically, if we go and tick, tock, 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 it's tick and tock and tick and tock and tick and tock and tock and tock. It's just an eighth note pulse. Let's just do it a couple of times. Let me show you what I want you to do. I want you to go, you're going to play that. So do that first of all. Get your, or get your hand moving like that. Try and get your, switch, switch to your down. That's it, that's it. So now, I'll tick tock you in and I'm on the first, after the count, okay, that's it. After the first count, it's D, is your, it's, D on your, it's D on your first tick. You're drifting a little bit there, so don't worry about it. So it's only because I can hear you. Right. So tick, tock, tick, tock, tock, tock. That's good, that's really good, that's fine. Try just hitting the, hitting the one hard, as you're hitting the change hard, and trying to make the strum the eighth softer. But, so do it like this. Soft, so you soften the pick. So like, say like, if you hold the pick loose, that's a, and what you do with that is try and, normally I would say that's fine, but just you indulge me. So try and make it up and down. So, when you're doing it, this is a beginner's thing this is, but it's still, it's worth remarking. You've got to be on, you've got to be down when I'm down. So, so you basically, I'll tick tock you to down. So tick, tock, tock, tock. To this. No, just downs. So it's on the ticks and tocks. Tick. Now when I tick tock, bring the upstrokes back in. Tick tock tock tock. And then tick tock you out. Tick tock tock tock. Sorry, that one happened. Now those downs are the same downs as when you're playing eights. So you bring the ups in. Tick tock tock tock. It's just ups coming in. All your upstrokes, all your downs in the same place. Tick, tuck, tuck, tuck. That's so important to do, to be able to do. That's like, just bear with me, we could do that again, but that's like, I keep dragging you back to fundamental, but at least everybody's, this is something that suits, that's important for everyone to see tonight, anyway. Is, that's the equivalent of being able to play a scale from the start to the end and being able to play that sequence from start to end in time. It has to be transparent. You have to be able to do that. You actually learn to do something in parallel. You're going... There's the chord changes. C, polythene, pan. It's double there, sorry. C, polythene, pan. And you can try that if you want. You can try just tapping your foot. So like, I can, I, can, I can see most of you. So, so it's like, so get the pulse going. And we want it fast enough so you can't count. And then you go, you go basically, I'll, I'll stamp and you tap your foot. So it's gonna go, you, just pat, you tap your foot on the changes. So you, you go, tick, tock, 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 C, part of the thing, pan. C, part of the thing, pan. C, part of the thing. C, C, polythene, pan, and then C, polythene, pan. Now, when you do that, when you do that, if there's any, if there's any slight, because you're tapping with your foot, that has to be taken up with an accented piece on your right hand. 
Yeah? So if we try that now, instead of, instead of tapping our foot, what we'll try and do is we'll put that, we'll go for us with soft pick, like we play it with a loose pick, so it's soft and quiet. Then double up. And so what I'll, I'll give you, there'll be tick tock 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 cues, and we'll go like this, we'll go. So it'll go, and first, no, so the first one will be fours, and then, we'll, and then it'll go tick tock tock tock, we double up. And then the next tick tock tock is your accent that ticks. So if you're not tick tock tock tock, If you the practicing type, does everybody agree and see how those have got to be there in order for the to work? Otherwise, it won't work. So you, you, you have to do two things at the same time, always with the rhythm. Your right, but your right hand should just be like it should disappear. That should just be ticking away at either fours or eights. We could do, we could, do you want to do a train? So let's do the train exercise. So you come play it with me, so just, just no accents yet, so it's like that. And we don't even I don't even have to tick it now, but just, you'll know how to do it. You can just do it by instinct. But you've got to be careful, Brian, because you've got to be on the downs. That's you've got to be on my downs. That's it. So there we go. And then we go. That's the train picking up speed. And then we increase the tempo. And so on. Now there's all kinds of things that, that, you, that you can address. The first thing is not realising the effort. You just don't realise the amount of effort that's needed to keep that going especially when you rise at the tempo. And when you get to a certain tempo, it will break down. But sometimes it's just because it's not familiar with putting that much effort. Realising that it takes more effort than you're putting in. Let's just get back to polythene palm. Let's do it with a chord this time. Downs. You've, now, now the point, what you've got to say to yourself as you're doing this is, as you bring the upstrokes in, the upstrokes are in between the downs. The downs have got to be in the same place. So you've got to bring, you've, and you've got to be on my downs. Otherwise, it's just not going to work. So you need to be on my downs, yeah? Okay. When you make the transition, those downs are still there. You've got to still focus on the downs. Now, now, now on the, now on the ticks, you put an accent. So it goes, it, it tick, tick, tock, tock, tock. Now, I'm going to tick tock you in, and then after that, we're going to do, we're going to change chords down to from D, A, and E. It's not quite polythene pan. It's going to go tick, tock, 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 D, tock, 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 A, tock. It felt then like it felt from watching the way you play that your right hand starts to take on an autonomy. The key thing is is that what you've got is this tick tock tock tock. So on the that's the, the universal symbol guitar symbol for downstrokes, even though you'd think it'd be that way. And then in the uh, when you put the ands in, you just have to put the, the upstrokes in, but they can't change. They can't change. It's obvious they can't change, it's just your body just sometimes doesn't want it, or your ear, or some part that you just stops you. The only thing we've got to do to change that strum to, 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 um, to, to polythene pan is we've got to go, we've got to tick, tock, tock, tock. 
So we've got to change twice as fast. We've got to go, but this hand doesn't change. It's, so I'll just show you what we're going to do. We're going to go. We just did a group of four on each chord. So we went. And then we did another leg. So that's what we did. Can you see that? But what we've got to do to, do, to turn it into part of theme cam, to turn it into that, we've got to shorten the gap between the D and the A. So it's got to go. And, that's, and the A as well. Be half the length on D, half the time on A. And that's, if you're thinking about that while you're playing, that's going to screw your head in because it's an instruction. Let's just spell it. There's an accent on the one and it goes. So it's down, up, down, up. It goes down, up, down, up for the D. Then spell, then you can think. You go to I, down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. And then we spell again E. Down, up, down, up. Down, up, twice. That's the spelling of it. Down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. Twice, yeah? That's only spelling it though. But now if you think about it, then we've got this. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. We, we should just go. So we, I'll try and jump straight in. So it's, if you keep that going, and it just goes. Down, up, 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 down, 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 does that start to sound like one thing pump? So you've got your right hand that's got to maintain the right pulse, evenly spaced. You've got to play an accent, harder strum on the chord as it changes, and you've got to keep the pulse going. And if you want to, like, you get that train with them, and that should get you 90% of there. So the way they do it on the record is they do the intro, And then they put a fill there. Now, well, you should see Polythene Pam is a pickup, so you can go, well, you should see. Then you've got the, well, you should see Polythene Pam. She saw the look you got, she looks like a man. And we're just going to keep doing that the two lines over. Tick, tock, tock, tock. Boom. You should see Paula Pim Pam. She saw the look in her, she looks like a man. Well, you should see Paula Pim Pam. She saw the look in her, she looks like a man. Can you the ones there? Yeah. See Paula Pim Pam. She saw the look in her, she looks like a man. So, again, so just bear, bear in mind the once you've got the right hand going, just accenting on the chord change, and you, you, you're there really. And, and the thing is, what you, once you can do that to, make, to bring it more alive, which is a bit, from, well, maybe a quite way down the line, but who knows, is you put accents in different places, like... You almost try and catch yourself out to try and stop, you, to try and push yourself off the downs by putting accents in funny places, but you can't lose track of the downs, or most of the downs. You know, but the point is there is, is you, you go from concentrating, spelling is full, just pure mind concentration and just pushing your fingers around with your mind. And you go to that phase where you start to get a feel and you think your mind has to retreat. But, at this, but when we get to this stage, you've got to throw things, your mind doesn't do it, you've just got to, any rhythmic, any rhythmic stutters that you play, you compensate you just learn to compensate. It's like, if somebody does this and pushes me that way, I'm either going to fall over or I'm going to gain, regain my balance. And it's like the rhythmic equivalent of regaining your balance without it falling down. But underpinning it all, the downs from the, the underpinning, just to take you through it again, that's got to, that's got to be there. The ups have just got to, be, have got to be slotted in. I say it a lot, but what I'm, what I'm saying to you is this, when I'm playing this, when, I, when you play this, and I change to this, you, 
got to still be able to hear the downs as fours. You've got to be able to hear those. You can still play them as downs. And then you finally have to put the, there's three like, does everybody see how there's like three layers? There's like the metric pulse. And then there's like, there's the metric pulse, which is the changes. Right, and then there's the, the, uh, the that's at the top, and at the bottom is this. The upstrokes, just, just fill it up. You know, it's like, you've got to maintain whatever the, the pulse is. One, two, tick, tock, tock, tock. You've got to keep track of that. And then if, I can almost describe what I'm trying to say, but the language is difficult, because it's not the way people generally express it, but, because most people would say that that's a pulse, and if you, well, that's the pulse, it's just, there's a pulse, it's the pulse. It's just the carrier that you, or the, you play goes on. But what I'm trying to say is, is the upstrokes are like, they're like part of the rhythm. If you, it, it, I don't want it, I would rather you not think of that as a pulse. I'd rather you think of that as the pulse. And that as a subdivision of the pulse. But it's almost like they're there. Because if you do this, if you, you can make a variation in your rhythm just by go, doing this. You can go. You know what I mean? There's all the variation. Just a few. I did, I, I, what I tried to avoid doing was putting accents on the ups, which I did at the start, and then I tried to. All I did then was drop out upstrokes. So I did one there, so. Just, just varying it. It's like that. You can do that as if you can. If you can really stay on the downs. You can treat it like a game with your upstrokes. Just, and you don't really think about, oh, I'm going to drop an upstroke out there or there or there. I'm just going to vary the rhythm. And, then, and that's what I say about being pushed off balance. It's like, if you, if, you know how hard it is to stay on that rhythm, right? And you try and push yourself off the balance by doing that. And you, get, you, you just do that for a few, and then you, jump, and you come back to it, and you might get pushed that way, and you go that way. Do you see what I mean? It's, it, it's just about maintaining that rhythm. I told you, this is why doing rhythm's a pain. It's not a pain, but it's, it's a feel. And, and I'm trying to get you closer to that feel, but you, you can't describe it. So let's do it. You play in the rest of the mood. Just get your... That's it. If, if nothing else, did, 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 that's the rhythm. Now, we you drop the changes on, if you keep your right hand, doing that and don't get anything wrong and just drop the changes you'll suddenly get polyphene pan so I'll tick tock tock you to the start of polyphene pan which is still a do so it's tick tock 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 see polyphene pan no good looking but she looks like a man Stop. You can see 